ecology, safety, taste, and health benefits. These requirements are raised by fruit and vegetable buyers today. Therefore, the growers should know the following: What is the most appropriate soil and water for certain species? Under what conditions the vegetables will retain nutrients? And which biotechnological innovations will improve harvests or ensure its more effective usage? The Open Access Joint Research Center of Agriculture and Forestry and the Center of Biosystem Engineering, Biomass Energy and Water Engineering of Alexandras Stolginskis University provide a wide range of services related with all processes of plant growth, usage and storage from water, soil, microorganisms, plant productivity or resistance testing to biodiversity of forest ecosystems, biofuel or biogas production. And recycling technologies for waste of plant origin. The Open Access Joint Research Center of Agriculture and Forestry is the most modern scientific research center of this type in the Baltic countries. New spacious premises, the most modern equipment, are all concentrated in one place in the Konas district in Academia. Here, not only are the services of scientific research are provided, people can carry out research, develop new products and technologies by themselves. Our scientists cooperate very closely with economic entities, companies, with Lithuanian manufacturers. There are eight laboratories equipped with modern facilities in the center. The scientists are able to carry out complex research work here. In this research center, the scientists from the Lithuanian Research Center for Agriculture and Forestry and Alexandras Stolginskis University unite their efforts in exploring biological resources of soil and forest and their usage possibilities. Foreign scientists and scientists and researchers of other Lithuanian institutions also work in this center. This unique equipment can be used by businesses, professionals from public institutions, PhDs, and students. The research on plant genetics are the most developed in the center. They are frequently ordered not only by Lithuanian but also Ukrainian, Latvian, and Estonian companies. Following the results of research, the scientists develop new species, implement the desired features in plants, thus increasing the productivity and disease resistance. Soil is explored in the laboratory of agrobiology. Chemical elements in fertilizers, compost, and plants are also examined. The scientists from the center also implement the orders of business companies. For example, currently, a globally new product, liquid fertilizer from poultry manure, has been developed here. The plant breeding material is developed. The impact of various factors, macro and micro elements, amino acids. Plant protection measures on plants is evaluated by using biotechnological methods in the laboratory of agrobiotechnology. The chemical composition of plants, biology of harmful organisms, and their sensitivity to ecological factors are researched by using non-destructive methods in the laboratory of quality of plant raw materials. In the environmental laboratory. The total organic carbon and nitrogen concentration in liquid and solid samples is found. In the phytotron, established in the open access center, plant breeding is performed. Other scientific research is also carried out. For example, ten new species of Asarina were bred within a year. There is a special temperature, day, night, and season control system. Therefore, tests are performed significantly faster than under unnatural conditions. The forestry professionals of the center, in cooperation with foreign partners, research forest ecosystems, impact of climate change on their sustainability, seek to preserve Lithuanian forests, the formed population. The university has one manned and one unmanned airplane for taking photogrammetric pictures that give not only 3D views but also the data on forest cover, the tree species and location. This service is useful to companies under the necessity of information on crop declarations, quarry areas for peatland monitoring or inventory of greeneries. Furthermore, the quality of wood and their products is examined. Wood processing technologies are developed and improved in the laboratories. 
one more activity field where the scientists of the center have achieved remarkable successes at the global level is technologies helping to use microalgae as raw material for biofuel production. The scientists from the center have improved the biogas purification technologies by using natural sorbents. These laboratories provide the services of analyzing the features of liquid fuel and oil and biogas. They're equipped with the following exceptional facilities. Modern equipment, the sophisticated premises of the Open Access Joint Research Center of Agriculture and Forestry. The scientists with long years of experience in their field, all these factors ensure high quality research to help to seek for important scientific results and promote closer cooperation of the center with business.